Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today we're going to talk about mouses, trackpads and devices that are used to actually uh, control your screen if you are not on a touch device. This video is really for people that have uh, you know good old laptops with their little trackpads and buttons at the bottom or if you're using a regular mouse to go through Windows 8. There might be options that you need to fix and work around and so depending on the machine you have your trackpad or mouse might have special features that are enabled for Windows 8 only. So how do you find these features? How do you change them? How do you change the speed of your pointer and so on? Two places to check for and that's probably what's a little annoying in Windows 8 is that you've got two two places to check for your mouse. First you can go into your search in Windows 8 or in your charms bar if you don't have the search on your screen. Just type mouse and here you will see mouse and trackpad settings. Click on that and check for the options here. Now here you've got the primary button left for people like me that are um, right-handed because depending on left-handed or right-handed people you might want to have primary primary button left or right. These are the general guidelines uh, how much scrolling the mouse does at the time stuff like that. Now touchpad delay to prevent the cursor from ac accidentally moving while you type for example you can change the delay you know we often touch or you know put our hand on the trackpad we don't always want it to react it's not always because we want it to react but uh, that's quite limited in what you can do if you get out of there and go into your control panel by the start menu and go into control panel or if you don't have the start menu or aren't sure go into your search and just type control panel and you will have the control panel tab show up now you might have categories go into the upper right and just change that to large icons here check for something called mouse but in my case I have mouse and mouse is pretty much where everything is being worked on the trackpad but depending on the computer you're using you might have actually trackpad options so you can check for those trackpad options. There might be a separate tab for that. Um, some HP computers, for example, uh, I've seen a separate tab or a separate icon that is only for the trackpad and its different options. But if you don't have anything else, you can click mouse and you'll have the options for the trackpad. Here it says devices is my synaptic touchpad. And here you have all the settings you need, the double click speed, right handed, left handed, uh, turn on, click lock if you want to uh, uh, add some special properties. You've got the pointer options, pointer, um, you know, the, the, the icons that show your pointer, what it looks like depending on what you want, pointer options for the speed of the pointer. Now. Here is basic stuff, but there's a lot of automatic stuff. For example, some trackpads will allow you to imitate a touch screen. So it, it means that when you actually slide from left to right or right to left, up, down, they will simulate what a user experience is with a touch screen when they swipe on the right uh, side of the screen, the left side, and so on. So all of these options should show up either here or, like I said, if you don't see them here, check for the different um, icons that can be very specific to your computer. This is on a basic Toshiba computer with Windows 8, but you might have a much more evolved program or icon uh, hardware for your touchpad or your mouse if you're using a mouse uh, Microsoft mouse 
if you're using a uh, Logitech mouse, they often have their own program. One thing you can also check for is in the program. So if you search for mouse in the search panel here, check for maybe something that is more specific because it can show you maybe that you have a special program for the mouse and check for that maybe Logitech mouse or Microsoft mouse a lot of these devices have their own program to actually work with the trackpad or the mouse so this is what you need to look for if you want to check for the different options of your either your trackpad on a laptop or a mouse if you're using a mouse on your laptop or on your desktop computer if you enjoy our videos why not subscribe to our channel you'll be informed when new videos are online if you have any comments or questions on what you've seen let us know maybe you have a feature of windows that did you like us to talk about let us know also we'll try to put that video online and hopefully you will come back to the official windows 8 channel thank you for watching bye bye